what you didn't know about piranhas. In this video, I'm going to show you some of the most interesting facts about piranhas that you probably didn't know. Welcome to Orthopedia. I'm going to show you some of the most interesting facts about piranhas that you probably didn't know. For example, did you know that they can smell blood up to a mile away? Or that they are one of the only fish that can chew through meat? There's a lot of misconceptions about these fish, and I'm here to set the record straight. When it comes to animals, piranhas are right up there with the big dogs. Many scary stories and movies have featured these savage predators because of their reputation for violence and their insatiable hunger. The piranha has been portrayed as a mindless eater and killer in movies like Piranha 1978. But are they like that in real life? The piranha's body is thick and narrow, its head is flat, and its jaws are strong and equipped with sharp, triangular teeth. The piranhas I've seen have been primarily silver with a few red spots. Adults of most species are between 20.3 and 35 centimeters or 8 and 12 inches in size. Piranhas are members of the family of bony fish known for having exceptionally strong teeth. White water streams are a typical habitat for piranhas. The piranha fish plays a significant role in their natural habitats. These fishes are primarily found in low and waters. Still, they are abundant abundant and have a wide range of habitat preferences, including those in both lotic interactions within moving continental waters and lentic interactions within still continental waters environments. Multiple piranha species frequently coexist, and some are extremely common. There are 20 species of piranhas in the Amazon River alone, and all of them can be found in the rivers and lakes of South America. The piranha is a freshwater fish endemic to the tropical rivers and streams of Central and Southern South America. The Amazon Basin is home to the freshwater piranha. All the local water systems are freshwater, while the oceans around the world are salt water. So piranhas don't live in the ocean. About 20 of a piranha's teeth are sharp and entwined with each other. Piranhas are one of the most feared bony fish, and their teeth are indeed efficient. They have a single row of extremely sharp teeth that runs around their mouth, top, and bottom teeth fit snugly into one another. The Pacu fish, whose dentition is eerily similar to human teeth, is a close relative of these creatures. The teeth of a piranha are extremely sharp and effective, in contrast to the flat teeth of a Pacu. The piranha's biting forces range from 67 to 320 newtons or 15 to 72 pounds and were surprisingly strong, given the size of their mouths. The jaws are powerful. Some people who lost toes to piranhas have lost the entire toe bone. This sight is three times as powerful as an alligator of the same size, making it the most substantial bite recorded for a fish. Even though they are primarily active during the day, diurnal species like piranha retain some night vision. Their lateral line detects variations in water pressure, allowing them to keep tabs on nearby currents, other fish, and potentially dangerous predators. The speed of a piranha is determined by its size. The smaller the fish, the faster it can swim. For example, the giant piranha can reach speeds of up to 25 miles per hour, but the average fish is only about 15 miles per hour. Piranhas swim so fast because they have a particular muscle called the myocomida that helps them move their tails quickly. This muscle is very well developed in piranhas piranhas, allowing them to generate a lot of force when they swim. As a result, piranhas can move through the water at high speeds, making them one of the fastest fish in the world. For example, a black piranha can display bursts of speed of up to 25 miles per hour. The San Francisco piranha piranha San Francisco, also known as the Piraea piranha, and the black piranha, is the largest piranha species in the world. The average weight of a San Francisco piranha is between 5 and 8 pounds. They usually range in size from 12 inches to 14 inches. The wimple piranha is the smallest species of piranha, with a maximum size of 6 inches. When compared to surgeon fish and species of pygocentric, they are dwarfed by comparison. The red-bellied piranha is the most feared because it has the strongest jaws and sharpest teeth of any piranha species. This species, which can reach lengths of up to 50 cm 20 inches, is known to engage in mass foraging when water levels are low. Carnivorous piranhas pounce on any easy meal flesh eaters. Its diet consists of marine, terrestrial creatures that have made their way into the water. Fish, mollusks, crustaceans, insects, birds, lizards, amphibians, rodents, 
and carrion are just some of their food sources carcasses. When given a chance, piranhas will eat anything smaller than themselves. If a school of piranhas is present, they may attack larger fish and even small mammals. Piranhas use a variety of foraging strategies depending on their developmental stage. Most of the day is spent hunting for food by smaller fish, while most of the hunting done by larger fish occurs at dawn, late afternoon, and early evening. Despite their fearsome reputation due to their sharp teeth and ravenous appetite, piranhas are rather timid and elusive fish. The piranha fish is typically depicted as a vicious predator that attacks schools. However, they can form communities of up to 30 members and only venture out of the water to hunt when there is a scarcity of food or blood in the water. The old idea that piranhas from schools so they can hunt more efficiently spawned this conception. However, evidence suggests that piranhas employ this defense mechanism to ward off their natural enemies. When they do eat, it's usually a chaotic affair with lots of fish vying for the same meal. Injuries are common when fish fight each other because of their powerful jaws. But the piranhas will also cooperate to herd their prey into small groups so they can all share in the food. They show the best and worst of working together in this way. Crocodiles, Botos, Amazon river dolphins, and herons are among the many animals that prey on piranhas in the wild. As these predators become less common, piranha populations boom in some rivers. Piranhas are caught by humans for both food and the exotic pet trade. In general, piranhas are very cautious creatures. Food is just one area where they are resistant to change. They patrol the Amazon for disease outbreaks in the wild. They help prevent the spread of disease by feasting on injured or sick fish. When it comes to reproduction, the female piranha lays a clutch of eggs in a river or lake to start a new generation. Main bodies of water, like lagoons, are typical breeding grounds for piranhas. At the time of spawning, piranhas' coloration shifts to red from the back. The piranha's intensity is growing, and it's getting a little lighter overall. Like birds, the pair will aggressively protect their nesting area and lay eggs there. The female builds in this end that takes the shape of a bowl, where she deposits her clutch of eggs. The diameter is 15 centimeters, and the depth is 4 or 5 centimeters. The male will fertilize the eggs. Depending on the temperature of the water, the eggs hatch in 2 or 3 days. The parents guard the eggs and young of the piranha fish. In April and May, when it rains a lot, women are at their fertile best. Piranhas are feared for their sharp teeth and notorious reputation, but do these little fish really pose a threat to humans? In short, yes and no. While piranhas will attack if they feel threatened, they are mostly scavengers that feed on dead animals. That being said, there have been reports of piranhas attacking swimmers and boaters who have ventured into their territory. In most cases, these attacks are not fatal, but they can cause serious injuries. The danger posed by piranhas is overstated, as there are very few reports of them biting people in their natural environments. However, People who put their hands into an aquarium with piranhas have gotten bitten. Despite the widespread belief that these fish are dangerous, tens of thousands of locals regularly swim in waters shared with them. The widespread belief that a school of piranhas can turn a horse or human into a skeleton in a matter of seconds is an exaggeration based on numerous previous recountings. While piranha schools can number in the thousands and bites are not unheard of, no one has ever been killed by a swarm of piranhas. The locals' tools and weapons often feature the teeth of of the piranha fish. Although piranha fish is a popular food source, they can be aggressive if caught on a hook or line. Fishermen and shoppers alike enjoy eating piranha fish, which is widely available for purchase at local markets. Recently, dried specimens have become popular buys for tourists looking for a memento. While piranhas have been known to bite, and injure swimmers on occasion, the danger they pose to humans is greatly exaggerated. But piranhas are a major problem for commercial and recreational fishermen because they steal bait, mutilate catch, damage nets, and other gear and even bite if provoked. So while piranhas are not likely to eat a human whole, they can still be dangerous if provoked. Piranhas are one of the most feared fish in the world. Their sharp teeth and voracious appetite have been known to attack and kill people. However, piranhas are actually quite shy and easily intimidated by larger animals. In fact, they are more likely to flee than to fight when confronted with something larger than themselves. Piranhas generally only become aggressive when feeling threatened or hunting for food. When hunting, piranhas work together in large groups, using their sharp teeth to strip the flesh from their prey. While their reputation may be fearsome, piranhas are relatively harmless creatures that pose little threat to humans.